How's it going everybody? My name is Casey and look at this. We have a new event in Family Guy, the quest for stuff. Awesome new event, Peter Griffin and the Kingdom of the Full Moon. It says for a limited time only, join Peter as he journeys to get to the bottom of a quickly unfolding mystery in Koag. Search and rescue an old friend, collect treasure idols, and win prizes to show off your hard work. Holy crap! Cleveland came to town last night and we got wasted. I don't remember anything. I have to find him and find out what had the hell and find out what the hell happened. Where the hell did this pyramid come from? I wonder if it's got anything anything to do with the Egyptian tomb I desecrated at the museum last night. So we have to explore the event menu to start your adventure. It also looks like we have a lot of time remaining. Over 31 days. Now it says, after a night of debauchery at the museum, Peter searches for Cle Cleveland to solve the secret of a mysterious pyramid and the gold moon idols in its wake. So we have to collect the idols, and then we get a whole bunch of idols and we just get items, I guess? We can buy stuff with them? I don't know. I assume so. Oh yeah. So for example, uh, 100 trophies will get you a golden cat and so forth. Okay. Whoa, look at that timer. That means the pyramid's gonna be open for a week. Oh, I didn't even notice that. So the event is 31 days, but this pyramid is only for one week. I don't know when Christmas is. Hey! Golden asses! Nice. Who's that? Peter? Peter Griffin here. What do you got? We have to collect more moon idols to win the bronze adventure trophy. Ah, I getcha. Makes sense. <laughs> Maybe collecting these mysterious idols will give me the answers I crave. Just like Ricky Cantina's Gimme the Tacos I Crave. Ricky Cantina's. More than just a place where a bunch of cops died. Surf the bird three times. Uh. Okay. What happened? Oh. Well, hell, I'm already on the other quests for a previous part, if you can believe it. So I can't actually do this yet. But it's okay. I mean, really, I mean, all you do, it looks like, is you just grind idols. And there you go, I guess. So I'm not going to be able to do the three surfing bird thingies, but it really doesn't matter. Because even then, you only get one for surfing the bird. I have to do it ten times anyways. So it's not going to make a difference whether I do it now or I do it later. So let's continue on. Let's look at this pyramid. Let's see what this actually is. What is the truth behind the pyramid? A large pyramid looms over Kohog, complete with strange hieroglyphics depicting an ancient curse. What secrets does the pyramid hold? And why does it smell faintly of beer? This sounds like a, myster a mystery that only Peter and Cleveland can solve. And you. They need your stinky finger. Okay. What is this? So I need 200 golden asses to clear this Egyptian museum. Or repair it, whatever that means. Or not whatever it means, but you know what I meant. Oh, I can't do that. Alright, let me just zoom out here if there's anything else I can do. Nope, it doesn't look like it. It looks like... That's pretty much it. So, if you guys have not checked out this new event, fire it up and start grinding those moon idols. Remember, the more you grind, the more that you can win. 
apparently anyway, and this pyramid, as we can see here, is only available for seven days. Let me just check these other tabs there. We have the Adventure Journal. And what is this star? Oh, so available for a limited time only, we have the Evil Monkey Statue for a ridiculous 10,000 golden asses. Or we can get bonus moon idols every few hours. That's cool. Oh, and we get an outfit as well. Characters earn twice as many. Okay. Ooh, this is going to take a lot of grinding. Holy moly. Jeez. That's insane. And I love it. This is exactly the same as the old events in The Simpsons Tapped Out. It was basically you would grind whatever currency that was in that particular event, and then you would just unlock prizes as you went along. The more you grind, the more did you get. I like that. You put in the work, you get rewarded. If you don't, you get squat. And that's the way it should be, in my opinion. None of this, oh hey, let's do a stupid spin the wheel. No thank you. Okay then. Well, I think that's pretty much it guys. You guys get the idea. Just put certain characters on quest if they have the option to get the golden ass. And then just grind, grind, grind away. If there's any quests, do them as well. And that is it. Pretty much that I can see anyway. If there's anything else that I'm missing though, just let me know in the comments down below. Because obviously this is just, you're fired up, you see what's going on, and that's pretty much it. So I'm pretty much bound to miss something along the way. But that is going to wrap it up for now, guys. If you enjoyed this video, show some support, show me some love, give me a thumbs up, like this video. That would be awesome. Thanks for watching, my name's Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye bye guys. This gameplay is called the Family Guy. The quest is tough. It's not the best name, but it is kind of funny.